Hello friends, welcome to Gate Lab. In this question, we have to find, uh, this is uh, a network circuit where we have to find the current flowing through this. This is my current, I, and we, I have to find this current. So here we can see that we have three sources available in this circuit. One is 4 volt, one is 1 ampere source, and another is 2 volt source. To make this uh, analysis simpler and this solution simpler, here we can use superposition theorem. So by using superposition theorem, we will solve this circuit. So uh, in the superposition uh, theorem, we will consider one circuit, uh, one source at a time. So here what we can observe that if we consider consider the outside source like if I consider the for this four volt then the my this circuit become like bridge circuit where I am providing four volt and this will be my z1 z2 z z3 z4 so this become a balanced bridge which implies that whatever the current uh, in a balanced bridge current flowing is zero so this will become zero again for run one ampere also uh, this will become a balanced bridge circuit so current flowing through this will be zero so using superposition theorem Then four, when four volt source is considered. Network become network is a balanced place. Implies I two will be zero. Similarly, when one ampere source is running, one ampere source is considered considered here again network will be balanced space so again my i2 will be zero now i will consider this two volt source so for this two volt source uh, by this uh, four volt will get short circuited and one ampere will be open circuited so i'm redrawing my circuit as this will be short circuit forum forum this again forum we have given one ampere will be open circuit so there is no need to, to include it now one in between it is two volt i have to find current this in this i here it's two ohm one ohm one and one ohm this is going to be one, one, and one. Now, I will simplify it more. This four ohm will again get uh, short circuited, and these two four ohm, this four ohm and this four ohm will be in parallel, which will become two ohm. So my uh, circuit will look like two ohm. I'm directly connecting. Here it's one ohm. This is two volt, two. This is my one. Again one. Here it's was one. And this two is connected. Now I have to make this more simpler. This is current I, which I have to find. So now I can observe that this two, uh, this two ohm and this these two one ohm now are in a pi network, or uh, I can say delta in a delta form. Like I can make this these two one ohm. I can now uh, connect like this one ohm, and again this one ohm. I can replace like this one. Ohm. So it will be in a delta form format. One ohm. One ohm. Now I will I will convert this delta into star by using the formula. So my circuit will look like 
now uh, my star circuit will look like this is 2 volt 2 here it's 1 ohm is given here it's 1 ohm and I am going to find these values of star circuit now as this is 1 ohm and this is going to be 1 ohm so my circuit will be like this so to get this value uh, from delta to star so it will be to get this value it will be multiplication of these two resistance that is 1 into 1 divided by sum of all resistance 2 plus 1 plus 1 so this will become 1 by 4 again to get this resistance 2 into 1 that is 2 upon sum of all resistance that will be 2 by 4 so it will become 1 by 2 and here also it will become it will become 1 by 2 so my circuit is uh, going to look like this 3 by 2 ohm this 3 by 2 ohm these two these 3 by 2 and 3 by 2 in parallel so now it will become this 2 volt this is 9 by 4 and this will become 3 by 4 3 by 2 parallel 3 by 2 will become 3 by 4 now I have to find this current I so my current I will become I equal to V by R so it will become 2 by 3 by 4 plus 9 by 4 so it will be 9 3 12 12 by 4 it will become 3 so my current will be 2 by 3 ampere so this is my answer thank you